guys, my name is McKinnon and this is Aiden. And we're here to talk about neurofibromatosis. Aiden, what is neurofibromatosis? Well, I'm glad you asked, McKinnon. Neurofibromatosis is a genetic disorder in which tumors grow in nerves throughout the body. I have NF2 and he has NF1, so I guess you can you call, call this Tumor, tumor Talk! talk. So Eden, I know it's Christmas. How was your Christmas? Um, my Christmas was really good. I went out and I, we went away and hung out as a family. And yeah. what did you get? What was your favorite Christmas gift? Oh my God, I, you know me, Anthony. I know. And you're doing it to embarrass me. <laughs> but I actually got a uh, scale model replica of Captain America's shield. And how excited were you? I really liked it. <laughs> I'm so happy you liked it. How was your Christmas? <laughs> my Christmas was great. I went down and saw my family and I got to see my boyfriend, so that was really exciting going home for Christmas. And the next day though, I did have to get um, a Vastin, so, but I was able to get my Vastin, which is always a plus. Yeah. I've actually been needing to ask you about that, and I didn't get a chance to really ask you about the last season, but what is it like having to travel back home constantly to get the Vastin? Well, I'm really glad you asked. I'm actually trying to move my MFs in up here because with work and everything, it can definitely be um, just a lot of time, you know? Yeah, you must miss a lot of work. Well, I mean, I have to work from home, and yeah. which is, I'm really lucky that I have the opportunity to be able to work remote, yeah. but at the same time, like, I, it's a lot of travel. It's, I have, my dog comes with me, so it's like, you know, getting all her paperwork and getting situated. But the good news is, is that when I do go home, I get to see like my family, yeah. like my friends from North Carolina, and my boyfriend, which is really nice. But it's definitely also not easy to work with having taken the medicine. Taking the medicine, and then it's also not easy taking the medicine, and every time I'm home, not feeling well and seeing everybody. Yeah, you're either working or you're like recovering. Right. Yeah. And I don't really have time to like really spend with everybody. But yeah. I can't just like take trips on the leisure either. So did you, did you at least get to wait until after the day of Christmas to take the medicine? So it was the 26th. So. <laughs> Not great, but, Not great, but it's I better than like the 23rd. It's better than the 25th. It's feeling like crap on Christmas. That's true, exactly. Or better than Christmas Eve. Yeah, but yeah, which would have been horrible. Right, which I'll take it. And I was really nervous about, you know, with my kidneys, I was really nervous yeah. about getting it, but I got it. Yeah. So I was really excited. Had it been a while since you had last taken it? Um, it's every six weeks. So for, for 10 years, though, it's been every like two weeks. And so they finally backed me off because of my kidneys. Yeah. Which is, which is like not a good thing, but it's kind of an awesome thing. Yeah, it's, it's like, like, you don't want to have problems with your kidneys. But it's an ice break. <laughs> yeah, but it's also like, but I also need to be on this medicine. Absolutely. And wait, how often do you go to doctor's appointments? For NF, I go down to the NIH every six months. Where I have to follow so, and do a ton of bad, yeah, do a ton of do a ton of like tests and stuff because of the uh, protocols or the you method. But that's great that you can take it up here, you know, even though it's like a you're on a medical trial, right? Oh yeah, because it's zip pills, yeah. Yeah, that's really yeah. nice that you can go. Yeah. That you can go home. So well, originally I had to when I first started, I had to go. I had to be. I had to go down there every two weeks. Oh wow! And how long did I go on for? That went on for the first like couple months of being on it. I remember I missed. I was in like I think like. That was great. I missed a ton of school because because in the beginning they had to they, they had to do blood work every like two weeks and they weren't allowed to outsource it to other places. They had to do it. Okay. So you had to go there constantly. Well, and I think this is like something really great to talk to our special guest about. Yeah. So we have some exciting news. We have two very special guests with us yeah. today. One has NF one and one has NF two. Yeah. So. We're going to be doing some exciting um, questions and answers and yeah. kind of getting their perspectives, which is something that I, re I personally really love about season two is, you know, yeah. kind of pulling Bring, more bringing in more people that we didn't really get a chance to do last time. Yeah. Yes. So we're really excited to welcome them. <laughs> 